Welcome back, this is The Gerbil, and I'm gonna show you how to use Keynote's pre-existing shapes here to create all kinds of original shapes by uniting, subtracting, intersecting, or excluding the difference between them. So I'm gonna start off with a simple circle and triangle from the shapes menu. And I'm gonna copy it four times for this tutorial, and I'm gonna copy it using the option key on your keyboard. All you have to do is hold on option, click them and drag, and you can duplicate them. Now, this is a really, really useful tool. If you're familiar with Adobe Illustrator, it works very similar. You just simply select your elements or your uh, objects, go to format, shapes, lines, and you have those four options. So I'm gonna go through each of them so you can see how uniting or subtracting create completely different outcomes here, right? The circle and triangles combined, we have a fish, or subtracted, we have a Pac-Man. I'm also gonna do the intersect and then exclude so you can see how those work. And with these, you can create all kinds of original, beautiful compositions. Thanks for watching.